Now that you're familiar with eHarmony, you might want to adjust some of your settings. Maybe you want to change your income or your preferred age of matches. I'm Allison from TechBoomers.com and I'll walk you through some of eHarmony's major settings. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to access your settings, how to edit your eHarmony settings, and how to change what emails you receive. To access your settings, go to eHarmony.com and log in if you're not logged in already. Then, click Settings in the top menu. You'll be automatically redirected to your match settings where you can click on categories at the top to edit them. You can also click the arrows on the left and right to show more categories to edit. If there's something you'd like to edit, click on it and it will show up below. For example, we'll make some edits in the age category. Click on the place you'd like to edit. Not all pieces of information are as easy to edit. For example, if you want to change your age, you'll have to email those who work at eHarmony. That's why it's important to be truthful when setting up your account. However, you can easily click and change your preferred age of matches. Click in each box and type in a number to set the preferred age range. Click Save when you're done. In the top header, select Account Settings to deal with issues like password changes, billing information, and your email notification settings. You'll automatically see the general account settings that allow you to change your password or your email address. Are you getting emails that you don't want from eHarmony? Select Email to check what types of emails you're being sent. As a default, everything is selected. They're split into categories, such as match alerts and other alerts. Other alerts include offers, newsletters, and other things. Match alerts includes emails when someone sends you a photo or an icebreaker and when you receive new matches. Click the check boxes next to each option to mark or unmark them. You will only receive emails about what you've selected. By selecting Billing, you'll be able to update any billing information from your payment method to your subscription status. Well, those are just a few of the major settings you can change on eHarmony. Feel free to explore all these settings and more. Want to learn more? Click the blue button to check out more eHarmony tutorials. Click the green button to find other website courses. And as always, click the orange button to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on the latest video tutorials.